All right, Iceman here um, with a quick review on the RS Products AKM mount. Um, I got it here on a Romanian SAR2 AK74. And here's the mount, as you can see in the video here. Very well made, very solid. Uh, attaches like your standard AK mount does. Quick detach so you can adjust that here, pull that off if you need to. I don't really plan on removing it because one of the most beautiful things about this mount is that it can be field stripped without removing the optic. We'll get to that in a minute. Now you can see the optic here is the Vortex Strike Fire. Uh, it's a great budget optic. I think it's probably the best budget optic out there for a red dot. Comes with the uh, the bikini or the uh, flip up covers here, and it has the screw and mount. As you can see, you can screw that mount in. That excuse, excuse me, not screw and mount, screw and magnifier. And you can screw that in with the flip-up covers on if you want to. And it fits really nicely on this AK. So I'm going to take that off for now. I'm going to concentrate more on the mount than on here on the uh, optic. But I know some of you on the AK forum were interested in how the strike fire worked with this mount. So that's why I wanted to do a video of it. And you can see the mount here is really solid, really robust. And you can actually use the flip-up covers. You just kind of have to flip up your front sight. And these aren't really the best covers. They don't stay very well. So one thing I do is flip that down and that stays there. And So you can still use the flip up covers. I might get something different for the optic. They're not the best option out there. But um, the mount's very solid. You can see it has the 30 millimeter ring right here with four very solid uh, bolts. So you can, I do recommend putting some blue Loctite on those. And then you have the um, second piece, of the, or the, the two piece mount. You have the solid piece here. Then you have this piece here that has a dovetail. And that's so you can um, adjust the mount so it's over the center of the board. I'm going to try to bring this in. I'm kind of in a limited space here, so I'm not sure how well this is going to work. But you can see how the uh, optic is right over the center of the board, which is very, very uh, um, new <laughs> to AK mounts. Most AK mounts sit slightly to the left, especially like on the PSL. Um, so this one sits, it's adjustable, so you can put it right over the center of your board. And then it has the two screws here. Once you've got it adjusted, it's really easy to adjust. It just took a few whacks with the palm of my hand, really, and I was able to adjust it to get it right over the center of the uh, the bore of the rifle there. And you have complete co-witness, as you can see, with the uh, flip that up with the iron sights, which is something that's very um, new. And one of the best features of this gun or of this mount is the cheek weld that you get. As you can see, the optics it's very low on the rifle and so you actually get a great cheek weld so there's very a lot of good things going on for this uh, this mount it's, it's really reasonably priced I think for what you get um, I picked it up from AIM Sports for about 130 140 bucks somewhere around there shipped um, highly recommend it uh, one of the oh, bumping the camera one of the coolest features is is you can field strip the AK with this mount on I'm not sure how well the camera is going to hold for this because take off your dust cover and for some reason on this SAR2 this is really a tight fit which is unreal for AKs you can see you can slide that right off take out your spring put your hammer down and of course the weapon I should have done this at the beginning of the video is unloaded no magazine uh, no round in the chamber and you can pull your bolt out just like that it's a little hard to get the bolt out here at the end, I did notice, but you can, not too bad, you can pull it right out. And there you go, you got a field stripped AK. So this is a short review of the AKM mount from RS Products. It's a new mount that's out in the um, market now and it's available from many different uh, retailers. Like I said, I got mine from Amy Sports, I know they sell them directly on their website. Um, I believe it's available from Brownells and a couple of other different sponsors, So, or a couple different retailers, so there you go. Um, works really well with the strike fire, as you can see. They, you could uh, instead install the magnifier as well on there, without any issues. That's one of my favorite parts of the strike fire is that it does come with a screw and two-time magnifier if you want to take a little bit longer distance shot. But gonna take her to the range tomorrow and see how she does. Thanks.